Get ready team, because it's a full body compound workout today. This workout is jam packed with compound movements using dumbbells and body weight. This workout is gonna give you that metabolic burn so that you are building muscle and burning fat. You're gonna see us hitting lower body, upper body, then firing up the body with a cardio movement. This workout is broken into three blocks, three movements, 45 seconds of effort with a 15 second transition, and we are gonna repeat this to get more out of that workout. Equipment for this workout is a variety of dumbbells. My lowest is 12 and a half, my heaviest is 20, a mat, and your amazing body. If you're new to this channel, welcome. Do make sure you hit that subscribe button and the bell so you're not missing any workouts. And if you want more, all you gotta do is click that join button below to get access to more workouts. Roll your shoulders back, brace that core. We're gonna warm things up. We're gonna be starting off with some squats. Open those feet up nice and wide. Drop down and rise up. All right, I got Carol here in the house today. Who's working out with you? Maybe it's just us. All right, in your squat, I want you to start to go a little bit faster because this workout has got lots of great elements. We've got compound strength and we've got some cardio moves today. Lunge back with your left leg, reach up, step in and switch. Nice big step back and then arms reach right by your ears. Open up the feet nice and wide, shifting lateral lunges. So drop over to that right side, come up center and left. My breath is gonna be inhale as I lower, exhale as you rise up. Really dropping chest to your thigh. All right, just get into a plank here, hands under shoulders, pause for a moment, and then hips come up and back down into plank. You can add a little right knee, left knee, and then down dog. Down dog, walk back. And a little march or jog. Jumping jacks or tap jack. You have your option. All right, you guys, we are nice and warm here. We're gonna get ready for that first movement, a moving squat. You're gonna weight yourself up at the top, be stepping out to the right, and then stepping out to the left. All right, are you guys ready for this? Carol, are you ready? All right, I'm gonna load 20s on my shoulders. They can be up at the top, stepping over to that right. In and to the left. So you're gonna see a lower body focused compound movement and then go into upper body and then a little blast of cardio. And then we're gonna repeat. 
And again, I want that moderate load. You got that 45 seconds on the clock. 15 second rest. Drop low in that squat. Bend over row for two, and then a curl press one. I'm gonna go to 15. So we're gonna drop that chest almost parallel to the floor. Pull to the hips twice. Stand up, curl press. Hinge forward. When you curl press, right, a little momentum comes from the back side. You gotta keep your core really tight there. Oh, I like that move. Doesn't it feel good? Got the whole waist engaged. All right, you guys, no equipment here. You're gonna do a drop squat one and then two jacks. You can always take that option of stepping it out with two tap jacks. Drop squat, two jacks, or step out, tap jack. I'm gonna try to go two fingers touch down, two hands. To touch the floor, make sure you bend your knees. All right, you guys, right back to the top, moving squat. Load it up. This time, let's start over to your left. Weight is up. Big step out, squat, and move. Inhale, you lower. Exhale, you rise up. Top load is good for waist engagement and your back. Keep your eyes lifted. There we go. All right, bent over row two to that curl press. They say that opposites attract. I guess I'm just a dog. Oh, it's gonna get hot in here today. How about your home? All right, pull it in two. And then a nice curl. Shoot it up. Remember, I want you pulling weights to hips in that row. Okay, so drop that chest. Pinch and pull. All right, you guys, no equipment. You got that drop squat and then move it into your two jacks. You ready, Carol? All right, let's hit it hard, you guys. Drop, jack. All right, you want to level up? You could do one jack, one star. Still 
Oh, Carol, you're going for it too. <laughs> yeah. All right, nice job. Okay, we got 45 seconds here. Get some water. Oh, catch your breath, right? Woo. We got a lateral lunge. One dumbbell, you guys, with a bicep curl. And we'll alternate that side to side. I'm gonna use my 25 pound dumbbell. Grab what you need. All right, your weight should be in your hand. It's gonna be my left hand. I'm stepping out to that right side, curl it up, and then over to the left. Step out, curl switch. So a little hammer curl, switching at the top. And again, the breathing is inhale, down, exhale, up. Maybe the dumbbell lightly touches the floor. Super job, I'm gonna keep this dumbbell to the back of my mat, push up. Drag the dumbbell to the front so it's behind my hand. I'm in plank. One push up. Grab that weight back there. Bring it behind that wrist. Push up. Other side. You can always drop to the knees. And some stability here, right? Run that one hand for a moment. Oh yeah, great for your core. Nice job. Oh my gosh. We got a little lateral leap. Carol, if you want to use a five pound weight, grab it. We're going to be leaping over to the left. A little swing. When you leap, have a dramatic pause. We're going to leaping over to the left. Swing. A little twist in that waist. Find some balance. Push off that foot. It's like a little hop over. Take your time. Get it balancing on one foot just for that moment before you push off of it. Nice job. Grab that heavy weight. Let's hit round two here. Let's start with it in the right hand. Go to your left side first. Lunge over. Curl and switch. Again, how low can you go with good posture? Remember, inhale lower. Exhale, you're coming up. Light it up. All right, in that push-up position, weight goes to the back. So it's just behind that back 
back wrist. Dropping that push up, grab and drag it to that front. Make sure your feet are open. All right, you guys, doing so great here. Come on, finish this off. Five seconds. Woo, yeah. Here comes that leap. Add a little bit of resistance if you want to. All right, get in that position. Leap to your left, to the right. All right, let's go a little lower here. Let's go light it up. And more pop up. Oh, all right, you guys. You did awesome. Woo, breather. Maybe a little dance break. Oh, yeah. We're going to go into block three. Last block, you have an RDL with a reverse lunge. I'm going to stick with my 20s here. Now just a reminder, when you do that reverse lunge, are right, you gonna do one leg first and then switch to the other leg? Right. And we're gonna drop in the RDL, pull the weight up, lunge. You guys ready to go? Roll the shoulders back, brace the core, push your hips back, a little power up, lunge. Waist down, butt back, power to the top. Slow here, then quick to come up. Look to your knees when you do that RDL. Feel a stretch in the back of the legs. Get the back of the legs, get the front of the legs here with this movement. All right, we're on our back. We got a skull crusher in these 12 and a half. Drop the weight at a 90 degree angle. Extend the legs out. Everything comes up, everything goes back out. Inhale, pause. Exhale up. Now, use your elbows in that skull crusher. And then you're going to work that core by extending the legs out. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. No apologies, we ain't got no behavior. Remember, pause at the bottom. Then come up. Oh, doesn't that make it harder? Love it. Stereotypes of propaganda. Super job, all right. We're getting ready for a little burpee. We're gonna jump back, all right? Jump forward in that burpee. A little hop forward, a little hop back. All right, hands down, jump back. Jump in, stay low. A little hop, hop. But I want your eyes up when you're gonna hop. Now, you can just here, a lunge, up, walk, walk. Right, lunge, up, walk, walk. Now, 
You can even just do reverse lunges. Keep it quiet. Doing great job here. Come on. Oh my gosh, right? Definitely need a break. Oh, woo. Okay, get that water. Or maybe you're like me. Maybe you got your BCAAs or some of your heartbeats. Woo, good for recovery. All right, get ready. RDL. Oh, I'm ready. Oh, here we go, Carol. Come on. Woo. Lunge back. I forgot we only had 10 seconds there. Woo. It's the end of this, we get a break. Sorry about that, right? <laughs> now push your hips back. Power up. Oh, I'm sweating. Finish that lunge. Nice job. Skull crusher. Come on your back. Start with everything down. So arms bent, legs extended out. Now I'll bring him up. Inhale, pause. Exhale up. You can just work arms if you need to. It's all about you. And everything you do, it's all about Watch your wrist to stay straight. Yeah, it is all about you. Oh yeah, here we go. Carol said she loved that burpee hop. <laughs> she was nailing it though, how about you at home? Come on Carol, you can do it. High five it, let's do it. Get set. Go for it. Make everyone count. Okay, use your legs, come on, but stay slow when you're hopping those feet back and forward. Come on, Carol. 10 seconds. Woo, yeah. Now we got that break. All right, you guys. Now you can get that water. Woo. Because we got a finisher. Five moves. Five minutes. Each one is done for 50 seconds with a 10 second transition. I don't know about you guys, but we are hot in the house. We had to crack a window. Woo. Get ready. We got a clean and press. Remember, 50 seconds on, 10 second rest. We're going to go one time through. Give me all that you can. I'm gonna start with my 12 and a halves. Clean it up. It's like a little upright row and then bring it all the way to the ceiling. Clean, push. Now, we're gonna go for a little, that tempo. Get underneath it, all right, when I do that. Clean, push. Drop it down, wrist stays straight. Oh, I got the rhythm, how about you? Up, push. And then when we're gonna go for that speed, we get that core engaged. Heart rate stays up. Very metabolic. Pick it in a 15, in my left hand, right leg stays, lunge back, palm up, curl. Palm up, 
palm up curl. Tap foot in, step back. Come on, fist to shoulder, squeeze it up. If one thing tires out, just continue with the one that's not tired. So maybe it's a lunge versus the curl or vice versa. Ooh, yeah. I'm feeling that fatigue set in. Other arm. You guys doing good at home? Palm is up. Lunge curl. Come on, fist to shoulder. What's going on with your posture? Don't sink in your waist. Oh yeah, I can hear Carol breathing heavy. Same thing with you at home. All right, I'm gonna grab my 12s. One squat, one squat jump. Go no weight if you're worried about your knees. One squat, one jump. You need two weights go down by the side. You have your weights here. Just feels different. Try different positions here. You don't have to jump high, but I want you to get deep in your squat. Oh, four mountain climbers. Then drop to your stomach for a super. Make sure you have room to move. Come down on that plank. Four knees in. One, two, three, four. Stomach down. Reach, toes stay down. Come up. When you reach in super, look, squeeze butt. Oh, nice job. Yay. Sit back in child pose and take a breather here. Well deserved. Oh my goodness, right? Yeah. All right, all four, please. Cat cow round the back. And then look up. Oh my goodness, right round it again. And look up. All right, down dog it. Step that front foot forward into lunge. Knee down, reach up. Hands go down, we're switching legs, down dog. 
forward lunge with the back foot. Knee down, reach up. And now hands go down, turn to the front into wide straddle. All right, we're gonna lateral lunge to the right, toes up, arm up, push your knee open. Man, he did great today. That just flew right by, didn't it? Switch sides. Open up. And it's always about being consistent in your workouts, your diet, your sleep. Wide straddle. Hold on to that. So my Apple Watch says in that short amount of time, it was about 222 calories in a, I think I call it like a mixed, like a functional strength training. All right, step it in, roll it up. All right, find your balance. Pull your right foot back and quad stretch. Whoa, all right. Especially after that. And that really was a metabolic workout, a quick one for you guys. All right, switch legs. And then open it up. Reach the arms back in T. Open up the chest. Thumbs go down. Behind the back. Interlock fingers. And release. Roll the shoulders. Big inhale. Having attitude of gratitude here. Reach it up. Reach it up. Reach it back. Pull it into your heart. Take a deep breath here, big inhale. Let it go. Oh my gosh, yay for you. Oh, I always say, just do a little body check. How's it feeling? It's feeling a little hot here. When we do that type of a workout, we're not usually hitting the heaviest weights that we can. We're kind of in the middle, so remember that. Don't ever feel like, oh, I had to drop my weight, but it's a lot of big movements versus more isolation. So you did amazing, and you know who else did amazing? I did. Oh, Carol, Carol did amazing. <laughs> yes, thank you, Carol. Make sure if you enjoyed the workout, thumb it up, comment below, and hey, share this with your friends. And if you want more, a great workout to do after this is definitely some kind of a standing cardio core or some floor work, you guys. You have an awesome day, and we'll see you back at the next workout. Take care.